Hello everybody. Uh, all good. Jay Good hanging out with you guys again today. Hope you're enjoying the videos. Please subscribe. Please like my videos and uh, you'll be notified every time I do put out a new one. Uh, again, I'm enjoying this process, so I'm going to keep going uh, until somebody tells me to stop. And then I'm probably going to keep going. Uh, so just wanted to uh, uh, have a quick video today. Again, one of the biggest challenges for me, I think, at the beginning was, um, I think, something that faces a lot of people. Uh, I cut out a lot of the things I love, and I'll be honest, uh, rum and coke was a huge thing for me to cut out. Uh, my family is from Barbados. Uh, <laughs> not to say all Bajans are alcoholics, but we like to drink our rum and coke, that's for sure. And uh, that was a big thing for me in the first 30 days of changing was cutting out alcohol. Uh, so I'm going to tie this one into a little bit of another story. Uh, and, and in terms of minimalizing cost, um, two of the benefits that I've actually seen from cutting out alcohol was first, uh, I didn't drink rum without drinking Coke. So Coke is definitely not good for you. Rum, there may be some medicinal benefits for drinking rum. Not to say completely cut out rum, but when you have two to three rum and Cokes every evening, uh, even if it's just a couple days a week, you are adding at least 150 to 400 calories, possibly more, to your diet every night. Uh, in addition to the food you're already eating, um, that can be a significant change uh, and, and adding a lot of weight. And I think that's what attributed to a lot of the weight gain that I did over the years, just a slow, repetitive adding these calories into my diet definitely took an effect. Not to mention on a Friday or Saturday night, getting together with friends and having a lot more uh, alcohol than maybe you should. Uh, <laughs> it happened many times. It's fun. You got to enjoy it. You can also enjoy a lot of things without the alcohol. So again, not telling everybody to quit completely, go go cold turkey and not have another drop of alcohol, but I drastically reduced the amount of alcohol that I drink. It's uh, it, it was a big thing for me to cut that out. So I did a 30-day complete alcohol cut along with some sugars and other things. Uh, but if you're going to talk about refined sugars, there's nothing more refined and high in sugar than alcohol. Um, there are, and like I said, there are better ones necessarily to drink, and if you drink in moderation there's no issues. And tying back to the amount of money, when you look at it, if you were to drink one bottle of rum, a 26 ounce or 750 milliliter bottle of rum, and you're looking at an average cost of, of 25 to $27, uh, over the course of a month, that's $100. That's not even including the Coke. Um, you just keep on building that up, $100, $100 a month, and there's going to be some months that are more and less than others, but on average, that's a, that's $1,200 um, a year in terms of just consuming that one bottle of rum per week. And I'll be honest, that's probably roughly what I was doing on average, not every week, but there would be other weeks that I'd probably have more, you know, to unwind and, and, and reduce stress. That's something a lot of us do. And it does make a big impact on your body. Um, so definitely there are better ones to have red wines, some white wines. Uh, there are lower glycemic levels like vodka, um, gin, but, uh, it can make a really huge difference. And if you're not looking at that as something, if you're trying to cut the weight, that's definitely something that you should entertain because people don't realize just how many calories are in one glass of rum and Coke or, uh, gin and seven up or, or whatever your favorite drink may be. So take a look at it. Uh, again, not saying you need to quit, go cold Turkey. Uh, don't judge anybody on any of those things. It's just what I did. Uh, so I hope this information, uh, was something to give, something to give you something to think about. Uh, if you have any questions about it, please let me know, leave comments, uh, whether you love it or hate it, uh, that's fine by me. And, uh, I look forward to those comments and yeah, if you like the videos, again, please subscribe and click the uh, the bell icon. You'll get uh, you'll get notified the next time I do another video. All right, that's it for today. Thank you, everybody. Appreciate the the watching and the comments. Uh, enjoy life.